Hey, this video is in regards to the Silesian Leadership Retreat, or SLR. Um, I can only speak on behalf of the Deaf and Peel Board as I went to the Deaf and Peel uh, Silesian SLR Retreat. Um, for those that are going to SLR and looking for some information, you're not going to get much information out of me um, because everything is a secret until you get there. Uh, for the fact is that if I tell you everything that goes on on the retreat, um, it no longer remain special to you and, and no longer remain special like if i tell you what's going on the retreat you're gonna expect something and it's 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 better when you don't ex you don't have nothing going in the retreat like having a clear head it's the best um let me see what some stuff i can tell you there's three things that your young team should be telling you or three things that your chaplain should be telling you number one protect your wood not telling you what that means but protect your wood. Listen to me. Protect your wood. I'm going to say this again. Protect your wood. When you go on the retreat, put on your hand. Um, protect protect wood right there. And um, just, I won't, t you, you won't find out what wood means until you get on the retreat. But trust me, you will, uh, you, you're going to like that, that, that information. Um, don't drink the purple juice. Don't do it. Uh, there's a beverage that is served and don't drink it. Um, I suggest you please don't drink it. Um, on my retreat, two of us had to, um, stay in our rooms and when i was SLRing, uh, when i was young teaming the retreat as a leader i had kept, i'm just gonna say this i had kept pepto bismol with me so yeah that's all i'm telling you um i'm not telling you any more about that drink uh besides don't drink it um number three is um it's an amazing experience you would never regret it go on the retreat um, I'm not going to leave you there. Don't worry. I'm going to give you some, a little bit more information. Dufferin Peel Catholic District School Board normally has the retreat at the St. Francis Center. Uh, in Google St. Francis Center, look, kind of look at about the area. Um, when you, if you get the chance to, I'm not telling you if you're, I'm not telling you if you are, or you're not, but if you get the chance to walk around the grounds at any time, please do go find that little lake, that little pond, lake, pond, yeah, pond, and, uh, and so just sit by it. Um, another quick rule, do not go on the white trail. There's many trails on the retreat and uh, that are near the place and you decide to go for a walk. Don't go on the white trails for the fact is the white trail kind of takes you to like the other side. And like, it's a very long trail. You won't find your way back. And there's like different branches that lead to it and you, you'll get lost. So don't go on the white trail, go on the other trails, the trail around, it'll tell you like time limits and so on. So that's, that's about it. Um, if you're going in November, bring warm clothing. Um, don't be scared. Girls, um, most of the time girls, um, share a room. Guys, my two retreats that I wanted, they didn't have to share a room. The fact is there was less guys than girls. Um, but for the girls, um, you guys will be sharing a room with a roommate. Um, I'm not telling you who your roommate's going to be, as I don't know, because I'm not your chaplain. But, um, for the fact of rooming, don't be scared. It's, it's fun. I wish I had a roommate. Um, I have my friends that had roommates and they enjoyed it talking. Uh, at two o'clock in the morning, but I suggest you take your sleep because you need sleep on the retreat. Um, what are some other things that I can tell you? Um, oh, uh, if you get the chance to check, uh, go on Google and search St. Benedict Parish. Um, their address is um, 2194 Kipling, Kipling, Ab Kipling Avenue, Toronto, Ont Toronto Ontario. Um, and it's just an amazing parish. So I'm looking at like a book that I got from them uh, about uh, Mary Help of Christians. Uh, that's a little bit more information that you're going to learn about Don Bosco. And uh, yeah, um, so yeah, go check out the parish. It teaches you a little bit more about the word Silesian, what Silesian means. An amazing community. Uh, once a month, they have a kind of reunion for those that went on the retreat or for anybody that wants to go. They kind of, it's it's something that they, an event that they do. If you go on the website, you'll see it and it's called Visitations. I suggest you to go. It's an amazing experience. Just to kind of get a above like you go above beyond the retreat um the retreat itself what else can i tell you oh my goodness be 100 percent present um participate don't anticipate like don't anticipate what's gonna happen participate in what's happening um i think that's about it because i don't want to tell you more oh my goodness i should have started with this saint francis saint uh, salesian the word salesian is named after a saint uh it's named after saint francis de sales um but the religious group, the relig religious order is started um, by a Saint um, John Bosco, um, and also known as Saint John Bosco. On the retreat, you will hear Saint John Bosco and Saint and Saint John Bosco. They're the same person. Don in a time means father, and it's just kind of, it's a sign of respect. So Don and John are the same person, okay? Um, 
yeah, um, that's about it. That's all I'm going to tell you. Speak to your chaplains. Um, they're not going to tell you any more information. If you Google it, nothing is going to come up. I'm pretty sure, I'm hoping this comes up, so this is all the information you really kind of need. Um, if you are young teaming, um, those that are going to SLR, please poke poke your ears together. I'm going to use some lingo that young team knows that you won't know. Uh, young team, when you go into your young team room, um, have fun. Um, and uh, uh, do as many, no, I'm going to try to figure out how to say this. Planca it up. That's, I'm going to, I'm going to say it like that. Dufferin Peel knows what this means. Planca it up. So the students that are young team, planca it up as much as you can. Um, those that are not, uh, don't know what that planca means. That's, there's a reason why you don't know what planca means. Um, but yeah, for young teams, planca it up. Um, also, um, have fun. Have very, be very creative, um, especially in the very first thing you have to do on the retreat. Um, daily, the very first thing on your itinerary, what you are told what you have to do, be creative. Be very creative. Um, it's fun. Um, I'm trying not to say as much because I know there's people that are listening to this that are not young teaming. Um, be fun. Do the like the first thing you have to do every every single morning. Have fun doing it. Like think creatively, very creative. And for um, oh, okay. And for ideas in of um, and I for ideas for that thing, you guys gotta think of how to do. Um, please email me or comment below, and I'll kind of comment below with your email, and I'll kind of send you some ideas on how to um, on how to do that thing that you have to do. Um, and in the young team room, I kind of we kind of joked around with this because. Okay, there's like, there's like this joke that a lot of the young teams say, and I like, it's a, jo I don't know if it's a joke, it's a joke, and like my year they did like a ghost check, and, and they're like come in your rooms and they check for the ghost, and they kind of joked around like how there's like the ghost of the season retreat, and um, the um. I'm just saying, young team, when you go into your room, go to the back of the room and I feel the floors. That's all I'm going to say. Just feel the floors and you'll know what I'm talking about, young team. Um, what else? What else? Oh, my goodness. Uh, I can't remember. Okay, that's about it. That's all the information I'm going to tell you. Have fun. Um, I'm hoping this helps a lot. This is a seven-minute vi video on this. So I'm hoping that you get some information from this. Uh, shout out to my young team. Thank you so much. Shout out to my family members. Thank you so much. And I'm glad that to have you guys as part of my family and my, as my lock screen on my iPad. Um, thank you. Um, you guys made a difference in who I am. And I'm glad to have you guys in my life. Uh, yeah, so everybody that you go on the on the trip retreat with kind of becomes like your little family, and this is mine. Um, yeah, and it's it's very interesting in retreat, and I suggest you to go on it. Uh, that's about it. That's all I'm gonna say before I get into more details that I'm not allowed to say. I'm just gonna end it with a three letter word, and young team in their heads are like, oh, I know it, um, and hopefully you guys are gonna get to know it soon. But I'm gonna say WEC. That's all I'm gonna say. And you guys will understand what WEC means later. <laughs> um, so yeah, WEC.